Hello, my name is Lana and welcome back to my channel. It's time for March book haul. The book haul is bigger than I expected, but it is what it is. I'm gonna start with the used books I acquired from my local library. There were getting rid of some books and I decided to take some in. And then the new books I acquired from the subscription boxes and I went to this book expo thing here in Latvia and I got some books there too. Let's start with the used books. First I have three little poetry collections by Latvian authors. This one is Oak Power by Rudolf Blavans. We have the author on the cover and then here is the title page. So poetry and some illustrations throughout the book. The next one is Zemes Dziesmo or Song of the Ground or Earth? World? Like it's the same thing <laughs> in Latvian by Fritz Bard. The same thing like poetry and some illustrations. And then The Cherry Rain or Kirschu Lietus by Alfred Kruklis. This has a beautiful cover. I like it. Like the cherry tree with some blossoms and this one has some illustrations too but like not so dark and all black more like just drawings so yeah then i got this one mati mayo by ryan's jakes i think it is like a middle grade it looks like it is some kind of a fantasy story with adventures and animals as main characters i don't i don't know I just liked something about this one. Maybe the spine. It is cute. So I got it. I will try it. We'll see how it goes. And then I got the collection of works by Virginia Woolf. This one has room of, of, of its own, of one's own. What is the full English title? I don't know. The Lighthouse, Mrs. Dalloway. And one more that i don't know definitely don't know the index english title for but yeah i'm interested in trying i feel like i have read something by virginia wolf but maybe i'm wrong i don't know maybe i'm mistaking her with someone else then i got two big classics they are each one is in two parts like in two big tomes. This one is War and Peace by Leo Tolstoy and so there is part one and two, three and four, two big books. It is, I don't know really what this book is about, but I would like to try some more classics and if I read classics, I want to read them in my language because that's how I prefer reading classics. And the other classic the big one I got is the one I have read. I didn't really love the books, but I feel proud that I have read them and I wanted to own them, so I have them. It is Les, Mis, Les Miserables, or however you say the title, by Victor Hugo. So, part one and part two, two big tomes. I don't know how many pages there are, 700, and I guess this one is a bit shorter, but yeah. I'm happy that I have it. Maybe I will reread them someday. Who knows? But I'm proud that I have read such a big book. Next pile is from the book expo thingy. And first two books I'm going to share are children's books and cat books. This one is Nyao Diana by Ivar Snaybarts. This is children's poetry with, of course, some illustrations but yeah and the other one is Minka by Magdalena Kulos and this is a story about cats there are beautiful illustrations and there are cats in it and dogs at least one dog I saw oh this is mother and kitties maybe two chicks chickens chicks whatever but yeah Two cat books. Then I got Jiki by Datsaruk Shan, and this is a sequel to a book I read last year, two years ago. I really like that one, and this is a sequel. They both are 
historical fictions set here in Latvia. The first book was about a woman and her daughter and love and things. And this is about the daughter. Excited to read this one. I got two of these because I got one from my mother. And I still have it on the shelf because I haven't taken things to her. Because I haven't been there. So yeah. Next three books are from the same publisher because I want to own all the books they publish and currently I have all of them because I got the three I was missing. The first one is Blackwing by Ed MacDonald and I think it is a dark fantasy. It looks dark and there is a bird. Raven? Is that Raven? Or Crow? Which one is which? I never know. I think this is a raven, right? Crow was a bit different, but it doesn't matter. I have the book and I don't know what it is about. Then I have Dune by Frank Herbert. So the Dune came out in Latvian, book one. It is a big one and I'm excited to read it. Uh, I've heard good things about it. I know there is a movie, haven't seen the movie. Will watch the movie probably when I read the book because that's how I like things and it is a fantasy, I guess. It has some kind of a deserty setting. Fantasy? Or was it sci-fi? Or sci-fi fantasy? Something like that. All I know that it is not a new book. It was written in or first published in the 80s. Oh, don't trust me. But it is an old one. And it has regained its popularity now because of the movie, I feel like. So we'll see how I like it. I'm scared of big books, so we'll see <laughs> how long it takes for me to get to it. But I will. I will. And the last from the book Expo Thingy and the newest one for this publisher is The Fifth Season by N.K. Jemisin. And I'm excited. I heard so many good things about the series, though people seem to love the first one the most. And it is a trilogy, The Broken Earth. Am I correct? Broken Earth Trilogy. But yeah, this is the first one. I'm excited to see what I think about it. So we'll see when I get to it. The last four books are from subscription services. First is a sequel. This Infinite Threads and this is a special matching sequel. And it is by Tahira Mafi. I have... I have the first book here. This Woven Kingdom. Of course I still haven't read it, but look at the cover. It is a beautiful special edition. Of course, I had to have the matching sequel. And here it is. It is beautiful. I have no idea what it is about, but that's nothing new on this channel. I have no idea about the month, but maybe February's Illumicrate Song of Silver Flame Like Night by Emilio and Zhao. This looks like a beautiful fantasy. And... It goes for my catabooks because there is a tiger. It's blue, but looks like a blue kitty. So it definitely is for my cat lady readathon. But look, we have creatures, not just tigers, like phoenix and some kind of a dragon and weird turtle kind of thing. But it is beautiful. Then in Fairy Loot Adult Box, we had The Adventures of Amina Al Serafi by Shannon Chakraborty. This is once again a beautiful book. Look how pretty it is. How the, like, the red thing pops out. Gorgeous. But the most exciting thing about this one is... I'm going to show the first, what I saw first. So we have a map... It is beautiful. And then I switched to the back and I opened. And can you understand my excitement when I saw this? There's a kitty. I hope there's a cat character in this book. There should be if there is a kitty on the end papers. So I'm excited for this book because it might be a cat book. But yeah, I have no idea what this one is about. But I feel like it's piratey because it looks like a like a kind of ship, right? It's like a mast 
or whatever is the word water it looks like a piratey kind of thing and the last book is city of nightmares by rebecca Schaffer. and can i tell you how interesting it sounds where the character in this book has a man eating spider sister like her sister is spider man eating spider i read it and that's what i have stuck in my mind it sounds interesting and i'm excited <laughs> to read i don't like spiders don't get me wrong i don't like spiders i tolerate them i'm glad we don't have big ass spiders here in latvia I don't know if I could survive big spiders like tarantulas just existing outside. No, nope, thank you. But in books, they don't bother me because I love children's time and there are big spiders in this one. So yeah, that's it. It's man eating spider. That's all I know about this book. So this is it for the book haul. It was quick and I didn't have much to say about most of the books because that's how I roll. <laughs> I feel like my book hauls are just me mostly showing the book and sometimes telling what the book is about, I know, but mostly I don't. So yeah, this is it. Please let me know what is the last book you bought because it is April now while I'm filming and I already bought six books, seven. Yeah, it's not good. It's not good, but I needed some retail therapy. So that's what I did. But yeah, <laughs> this is it for this video. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed and see you in the next one. Bye. Peace out. That I know nothing. Just know.